much. It is great to see all of you. In the past, we used to have these get-togethers every other year and so on, but uh, COVID was a break. I guess the last one was just a month before COVID, so almost four years ago, February 2020, I believe. Anyhow, uh, let me introduce my wife and daughters and my son, Bana, here. Oh, yeah, my wife, Bana, is here. Uh, many of you know her already. She's a family physician in, uh, practicing in Ottawa. My son Adam is over there. Adam is a graduate of Carlton Computer Engineering. He is working for uh, avionics industry. And then next in line is Sezgi. Sezgi is a second year student at the University of Toronto Medical School. And last but not least, Essen, Essen is second year uh, health science in uh, Western University. I think people met each other, uh, but I think it will be good very quickly uh, if everyone just in three minutes introduces her research. No, no, no. <laughs> but, but I will just very quickly go to uh, maybe starting just here. Wafa is a postdoctoral fellow. Uh, next to her, uh, Pablo, another postdoctoral fellow in the room. Uh, his uh, wife, I uh, just the name escaped me. Roxana. Roxana, yes. And then Jale, a former uh, visiting professor from Turkey, and now Jale is at Ericsson, Ottawa. And then Hussein, Hussein Hoshnevis, a former PhD from the group now with. Um, Telesat, I believe, if that is correct, but I'm not sure. <laughs> and then uh, Faisal, a, a visiting PhD student from Algeria. Bilal, a visiting PhD student from Turkey. Meli, a visiting master's student from Turkey. Diraj is a PhD student. Cinta over there, PhD student. <laughs> professor uh, Metin is a visiting professor from Turkey and his uh, wife Nagin is a visiting PhD student at McGill and uh, Amel Hanum, uh, Professor <laughs> Abbas's uh, wife. Uh, but I, I missed the little one. Neva. Neva. Neva, yes. Neva <laughs> is a five year old. <laughs> and then let me move to this side. Nesrin, a former PhD student yes. with me and Professor Abbas. She is with Dell now. And then Princess Amira, right? Yes. And at the back, uh, uh, let us start with Rosita, a visiting PhD student. And then Maryam, a PhD student in the group. Her husband, I. Our husband. Yes, thank you very much. And then Apsu, a PhD student in the group. Her husband. Reza. Reza, yes, thank you very much. I guess I have to step down. And then Hong Chao, a PhD student. I'll just come to Faraj, a former uh, PhD student in the group now, an entrepreneur, is that right to say? Kind of, yeah. Oh, yes, that is very good. And then uh, Mohammed uh, al Zanar, a former PhD student now with Huawei. And then um, uh, Amin is a, a current PhD student, his wife Afra, yeah. yes. Uh, nice uh, to see you all. And then, oh, Professor Abbas, yes, uh, uh, our family friend and uh, long time colleague, now emeritus. Very happy to have you as well. Thank you for uh, accepting the invitation. Um, and then, Bora, Dr. Bora, yes, now a postdoctoral fellow at the University of Toronto, right, Bora? That's that right. is correct. Did I? Yeah. Oh, yes. Uh, yes, yes. Uh, my name is Fatih. Fatih, yes, that is cool. And then Kamil, a former PhD student, now with uh, Marsh. Marsh. Marsh Networks, that is right. Ekran, <laughs> don't hide. Don't hide. Yeah. <laughs> yes. Ekran is a former PhD student, now with Ericsson. Yes. And Enes is uh, Wafa's husband. He is Dr. Enes, is with Ericsson as well. And then we have Many kids downstairs. But, uh, <laughs> right? Is anyone in this side? No. No, right? No. Okay, that, that is really good. Just uh, very quickly, logistics. Uh, the food is here. We will uh, just start eating in a moment. Uh, there is a washroom here, as well as downstairs for, uh, also upstairs for uh, overflow. Um, fire doors, no, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> um, what else? Uh, 
Yeah, well, basically it is just an informal gathering. Uh, it is um, a day to be together and network also. Um, uh, in our long careers, especially like me deep in, in my career, this was year 25 at Carton. Uh, not necessarily an achievement, it is an indication of aging or uh, counting back to the retirement. Uh, lots happen, uh, but uh, in my career I think the most satisfying and fulfilling thing is to see uh, the people that we work with, whether those are undergraduate students, graduate students, postdoctoral fellows, uh, the professors that I collaborate with, the younger ones, they move forward in their careers this is really such a delight to observe. Obviously with grad students, uh, we also develop a special relation over years and stay in touch uh, for a very long time, uh, especially with those uh, who are in Ottawa. Now, uh, grad studies is a roller coaster experience. I guess everyone will uh, agree with me. Uh, this is just the nature of the beast. Uh, but I want to make sure that in my group, no one is left behind uh, everyone has the opportunity to show his or her potential. Um, uh, these are your best years in life, uh, young, energetic, healthy, so on and so forth. I would be uh, so sorry if anyone says or thinks that my graduate studies was a waste. I, I just want to make sure that everyone gets the best training and also, uh, I'm just emphasizing that enjoys. Uh, my own graduate studies years at the University of Toronto back in the 90s was among my best years uh, in, in life. Lots of, uh, not only good training, but lots of friendships. Uh, I, I am in touch with uh, many of them still. Uh, but first and foremost, and I guess the Biggest achievement of my life being met with my wife Anna. <laughs> and, uh, in some student clubs, I uh, was very active in the in MSA Muslim Students Association and executive member. Those were the formative years of the Muslim community early 90s in Canada. So uh, here we go. Um, uh, it is not only research or studying. Again, enjoy, have fun be active, do sports, uh, socialize with friends. I am unable to attend all the gatherings, but where is Hong Chao, our uh, special uh, events master? Okay, here we go. Thank you very much, Hong Chao, for monthly events that you are organizing. Uh, much appreciated. I wish you all, uh, all the very best in 2024. Good health, prosperity, continued success. Health is very important, that became more apparent to me after I had my, you know, toll on the eye problems uh, a few years ago. Having said that, um, there is something even more important than health in life, obviously, and that is uh, to, to kind of uh, walk on a straight path, if I may say, with dignity, with integrity, with good morals and ethics. I'm not sure what would be the right word in English, but um, in, in some languages, in Arabic, Persian, Urdu, and so on, there is this word, istikama, to be on a straight path, uh, again, to walk in, in the right way, with right ethics. My own wish and prayer for 2024 is, I want to be among those who are on, a, on the straight path, and I wish the same for all of you. Enjoy, and uh, there is no leaving time, you know, uh, until midnight at least. Uh, we are here, tomorrow is also vacation, and uh, uh, looking forward to chatting with all of you. Thanks for coming again.